tests are still there. Never, so, never stop. Did you change your number? Well, I'm a professional author, so I have a whole bunch of contacts coming mm-hmm. into my phone number. Got it. So and now, Norm, Norm to... let me play for my listeners this. It was part of the TV uh, report up in uh, uh, Milwaukee, but here's Norm MacDonald, who now is, of course, deceased. Hey, this is Norm MacDonald here, and this is a message for all of Patrick's friends. Uh, I want you to stop picking on your friend Pat. After all, and I quote, his only crime was that he didn't find Norm MacDonald funny. Bye-bye-bye. Wait a minute here. I'm Norm MacDonald. Huh. And I am funny. Please continue insulting that fat loser. Ah. So, Patrick, um, you, you can't change history, but um, could you perhaps reevaluate your thoughts on Norm MacDonald, or is that off the table? Well... I don't really, I think it's kind of gone past norm at this point. You know, mm-hmm. these people have dug into my entire life. Uh, they found out my pregnant wife left me for my neighbor years ago and since turned it into a way to harass me just because I signed away the rights to my daughter. They even went to my high school and got my transcripts and found out that I had a 1.7 GPA in high school. What are you uh, uh, planning on doing going forward? Oh, uh, well... I belong to a sci-fi group called the SFWA, and they loaned me $100,000 to try to sue these people. Yeah. Uh, well, when I we read went that. to court. I read that, that the, the website wouldn't divulge who was posting. Yeah, you, that was a dead end for you. I remember that. Right. So now yeah. I owe these people $40,000 of money I don't have. Hmm. Well, I sympathize with you. I, I, I thought it was an interesting story, but uh, I, I feel for you. I really do. Well, I appreciate that. I don't know what that does for you, but uh, I would say if you're within the sound of my voice and you're part of these uh, wacky funsters that uh, pre- prey on Patrick, let it go. It's not funny anymore. Patrick, thank you for calling in. I appreciate it. I wish I had more time to talk, but I, I have to go. But uh, best of luck to you in, in your future publishing efforts as well. well. Thanks for taking the time to talk to me. Take care. Patrick Tomlinson from Milwaukee. Please leave him alone.